Hey guys, it's Brenda from My Me Blueprints Cradle. I am feeling a lot better. Yay. And I still have a little cough, but nothing too bad. I have someone in my arms who I really want to share with you guys. Look who I have. <laughs> Can you see? He is an open-eyed Levi, and he is so precious. So, here he is. Oh my goodness. Um, I bought him as a pre-painted kit, and I um, put weight into him. And I stuff them. But that's not what this video is about. Today I want to compare this beautiful replica Levi. And I have an authentic Levi that is part of my collection. So, oh my goodness, look at him. But when this cake came out, I just had to get him. And I do want to change him into another warmer sleeper. I finally had to turn on the heat last night. So, and where I live, I'm in northern Canada. So, it actually is late in the year to turn on the heat. It's just good. He is done. So well for being a replica, in my opinion. So there will be interruptions <laughs> because I will stop recording when I start coughing. But... So not many people know that I have this Levi. Actually, I don't think, I don't think anyone knows. <laughs> no one know. Oh, I did tell very recently how many replicas I own in my collection. And it's growing because they're all so cute. And also now that I have like good lighting, I would love to show um, like exactly the details that we have. So here is a replica Levi. I bought him from AliExpress. And this is before I discovered them on Timu. Now I go to Timu because I take advantage of their coupons and their offers. And so what I end up doing is I love I love Timo for all of their stuff. I buy like kitchen items, household items. This shirt is from Timu. Um pants, shirts, jackets, um slippers. I tried their shoes, but they're not my favorite. Um like everything, hair stuff, bathroom, accessories, toiletries, um, <clears throat> and I really, I really enjoy that place, I really do. I mean, I bought, like, shelving units, um, wardrobe, closets, <laughs> yeah, I have bought a lot of things. So, what I do is I end up taking advantage of their coupons, and plus I love their free shipping, and um and then I buy my dolls at really cheap prices so because AliExpress um their prices are actually a lot less than Timu's but 
on AliExpress, there are shipping fees on a lot of their stores, a lot of their dolls. And Timu, everything is free shipping, so. And, like, I bought these from Timu, which are, like, really good quality. Um, I bought these from Timu. They're pure silicone. I opened those, like these. Um, this is from Timu. I got, I'll show you. That thing on my wall is from Timu. Like, there's one of the wardrobes I got from Timu. Um, the shelving unit, this one I got from Timu. And all of, every single thing, these uh, containers, the drawers, the beads. Well, those beads are from the dollar store, but, like, this cute little, actually, I got that for free. Um, these earrings from Timu. All of these, these are, you know, the magnet the pacifiers without glue um, my tutorial that I made these are first aid tapes and you can even get like these kind of first aid tapes all of these things are from Timu um, my containers my packaging is from Timu oh and I have more of these like these fake vines she is from Timu. <laughs> so yeah, I I love Timu. And these I love those vines. Uh these ones have lights. I have a couple of them that come with lights. Anyways, I love Timu. And then I take their coupons and I put it towards the dolls. Even these lights. Like there's that light and you can also mount a, um, a camera like your phone onto it and it can swivel it's like an led light and it can do different colors and i also got this light right here that can also move in any direction or it can be this way i don't know i love timu i really love it So let's look at this little guy. And by the way, Francis named him. His name is Michael Knight. <laughs> so this is Michael. But here, wait. Zoom in. I mean, for a replica, he is, in my opinion, very well done. Like, <laughs> and these are what his fingers look like and his hand his painted hair it's like this his ears now he has no lashes but that's okay I feel like I want to add more like weight in here and I'll show you my authentic Levi right away. And we'll put them side by side. But I wanted to show you, like, his legs. He does look a little shiny on camera. And he does feel different than my authentic Levi. But... <laughs> Overall, I really love him. Okay, my authentic Levi is named Brennan. And here is Brennan Wesley. Okay, zoom out. <laughs> so, you can obviously tell a difference between the replicas and the authentics concerning their paint. I watched a video by um, Shelby, um, I forget her new channel name, I'm sorry, but she was saying, wait, before I cough, she was saying that, like, nothing compares to an authentic Reborn Artist made 
dull and that is very true um as for the painting like the replicas manufactured comes like is still very well done but like a real authentic there's nothing like a real authentic reborn now this one was made um his body has a little more stuffing in it so I want to compare the two now it seems like michael's head is bigger but it's just a camera um let's see how close i can get them they're they're not they're the same size but as you can see sorry about my voice again the authentic version is painted tons more realistically than this guy <laughs> uh, but like I was saying for a replica I mean it's not bad this guy looks like a little more on the yellowish tones this guy is more rosy toned now let's see their mouth Now, I love how the replica, like, see, it looks pretty realistic with that <laughs> shine. And he's got some, like, around the eyes there and around the, slightly around the nose. Now, if I change to Brennan, he has a lot more, like, gloss. Oh, that's the word. I was trying to find. He does have the glossy lips. Um, there's nothing really around here. There's some, like, on the inside. If you could, the light's not picking it up for the camera. Maybe if I would not, now you can see, like, on the inside of the eyes. And. This is the replicas. So I think both versions are, are really, really good. Um, Money-wise, of course, there's a huge difference. But I mean, the price of a replica is totally... Like, how can you pass it up? I mean, well, the people who pass it up are the people who believe in their authentics which they have their right to buy authentic only but if you are willing to use your money towards a replica i would totally recommend replicas um if you have the money and you never experienced a real authentic reborn i would definitely at least have one in your life this guy has the scratch too which is like right you see that so i mean i love how the artist can add and like there's a stroke bite can add their own special details oh yes and let's talk about the hair next so this is a very well i love this painted hair uh, the artist of this doll is Wendy of Weeby Dolls, and she, I love her. I own many <clears throat> of her dolls, and I love them all. However, I can't afford them anymore, plain and simple, I just can't. My last one I got from her was my Max by Lorley Eagles, and I love him so, so much. But yeah, I, can't, I just can't afford it <clears throat> anymore, especially with the bills. Gas prices, hydro went up, hydro is our electricity, um, propane went up. The, I can't believe it, they're now charging us 
a renter's fee on just a machine. Like, really? It's like, oh my goodness. Anyways, enough talking about that. But yeah, I think I would, um, this guy, this guy is stuffed thicker, so I'm going to add more to him. I do have some polyfill, uh, around, so, but I love them, they're my new twins. But I want to compare the two, I mean, oh, I was talking about the hair. So this is manufactured hair, which, I mean, isn't bad for a machine. Let's see. He does have, like, the swirl, a slight swirl right there. And this is Brennan. It's her job. Let's see if I can do it side by side. Oh, Brennan is so sweet. That's it. And there's Michael. He's, yeah, he's sweet too. He just needs some more filling. Okay. So, you can, like, the authentic doll looks extremely realistic. And then you have, it looks not bad. I mean, it doesn't look realistic, like, as realistic. It looks like, a, like you know, a computer did it, <laughs> which it, in a way it did. But, um, I mean... They're very close, though. Well, not very close. They're close. But I am so happy that they could be twins. I just need to add more weight into this guy. But I mean, this cloth body came with him. Um, the zip ties came with them, like the small. Like, look at their feet. I'll move the camera. So here are their feet. There's one. There's one, and there's the other, and there's not much like difference in how they look. Not bad. So yeah, this is my Michael Knight. He is so sweet. And I will have to put him into an outfit. Oh my goodness. But. <laughs> so yes, guys, I am going to go for now. I can't wait to spend more time with you guys being on the channel. I will be here making more videos as tomorrow is a day off for me. And then next week on Monday is also a day off because we have Thanksgiving in Canada. So yes, we have our Thanksgiving in October in Canada. Um, but this upcoming Monday, wait. This upcoming Monday is in lieu of Every Child Matters Day, the uh, Reconciliation, Truth and Reconciliation Day. So, I can't wait to spend time with a hobby. I mean, it's so peaceful and I love it. And I have, I have a few dolls to reweight. And I do have videos on that, by the way. And also, I can't wait to reveal my replica collection because it's growing it's growing and i have a few more coming that i can't wait um but i've only shown a uh, long time ago a couple of replicas but since then i've opened up a few <laughs> more i did show a few blanket reveals on a couple of replicas that i own but there are a few dolls in my collection that i, I 
didn't show yet. So I can't wait to do that now. Okay, I'm just going to set him down. He's kind of heavy and he's making me cough even more. <laughs> My... <laughs> I've been collecting Reborn dolls since 2015 and they were all authentic, all of them that I've owned. I can't remember when I opened up my very first replica, but it was by AliExpress and it was a completed painted kit that I purchased. And then I opened up a Maddie, a completed finished doll Maddie on my channel. Oh, I still have her. She's up there. <laughs> I try not to show the replicas in my videos. But you know what? Oh, why not? One of these days, I will definitely share with you my replica collection. Oh yeah, here's here's what I was trying to say. Oh my goodness. Um, I do consider my authentic reborn collection separate from my replica collection. So, uh, coffee fits after. I need some hugs. <laughs> I need some coffee medicine. I consider my two collections different. It's just the same with my baby lives that I collect. They're completely different, but it's a collection nonetheless. So I do have my authentic collection and I do have my replica collection. And I'm going to go before I, I keep forgetting my words and forget to say bye to you. <laughs> and my eyes, Terry, I gotta. We're going shopping right away, so. See you anyways, guys. I hope that you have a great weekend. Thank you so much for being here. I do feel better. I promise it's just I'm not used to talking this much. I just need to rest my voice and get back into under some nice warm blankets and watch some favorite shows. But until next time, guys, thank you so much for being here. And until next time, very, very soon. Bye, guys. Much hand, bye, guys. Love you. Bye. Bye, guys. Thank you to all your comments and all your likes. It really, really means a lot. Bye, guys.